Hello. How's it going? I asked you a question. Don't answer me, chat. Just freaking sit there. I asked, How's it going? Freaking what? Freaking answer me. Mansor me. Yeah, I've used my flight stick today. It's pretty freaking sweet, but holy crap, it's like trying to ride a bike for the first time. I gotta get used to it. It's crazy cool. I bought a flight stick and a base combat seven. And because they were I bolt I got them both on a sale, it was both of them together was cheaper than the full price of this flight stick. This flight stick was originally $70 and it was $30 off. And then I got Ace Combat 7 for $20 because it was on sale today. Of all days, it's just like, hey, $20 on sale. It's like, the freaking gods have smiled upon me. It's a HOTUS 4. HOTAS. HOTUS. This is how... I don't know how you're supposed to freaking play these things, but this is how I do. Like, how else are you supposed to do this? Um... I have this piece of wood and I'm just sitting it on here using it like this. I don't know how else I'm supposed to do it. Like, what else would I do with it? So I just have it sitting on this plank of wood and I just play like this. Yeah. Now I don't know what the frick I'm going to do with it when I'm, like, not using it. Because I have no room at all. At all. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to stick with that, I guess. I've wanted that. I've wanted that flight stick for years. I just could not bring myself to spend that much. But it was 50 bucks. Instead of 70 or 80 or however much it freaking usually goes for.
telling you what, this dude I follow on Twitter, I don't know if it's good or bad. He just endlessly, all day, every day, posts amazing sales online. Video game related sales. And he posted this today, too. Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate. It's $20 right now. I'm, I've been debating, but I don't think I'm going to do it. I probably don't. I don't even know if I'd play it, but that's a cheap freaking deal for that game because these games never go on sale. Monster Hunter World is like 20? No, it friggin' is not! The frick you want about? Yeah, ignorance is bliss, it's true. I followed him long ago and then I unfollowed him because I think I just was like, nah. Wait, you're right, Monster Hunter World is- Oh, because Iceborne came out, that's right. It's 20 bucks because Iceborne came out. I already own Monster Hunter World. Is Iceborne on sale? No. The guy on Twitter is Wario64. He's a pretty- Pretty quote unquote famous Twitter dude. Endlessly posting video game sales. Seriously, just go to his Twitter and scroll down. It's just endless video game sales and peripherals. Oh, I didn't contact this store yet. All right, I'm opening this tab right now. I bought something from this store and they never shipped it. I bought it. One, I don't even know, like a month ago? Over a month ago? What is that website called? Thank you for the follow, by the way. Open the email right now. I don't even know where that freaking email is. I don't even remember what the website's called that I bought the thing from. Deep discount, there it is. Deep discount. Alright, I need to contact them. Leave that tab open. It's funny because I text, I, I contacted them weeks ago and said, hey, where's my product? And they're like, oh, this one's a pre order. It comes out on the 30th of January. Okay, wait a few weeks. 30th of January comes, and it's been like two weeks later. 30th of January has gone. So now I'm going to contact them again. Worked on this game. Let's see.
Well, hot diggity dang, that looks like a video game. Hope it sells well, dude. That looks pretty good, actually. It looks like a legit video game. What did you work on specifically? Oh, you made some gore sounds. Oh, yeah, you're the, you're the one that does the video game audio. That's right. Endlessly browsing this awful website. It's just awful. This thing's been stuck here for a while, huh? This was like this last time I tried it. Dang, I thought someone would have gotten that by now. Let's try. Let's try because I totally have a chance. Totally. The odds are in my favor. Love Peter. The frick did it say? Man, there's just no way. Cat Killer 5, 29 months, bro. Thank you, dude, for that amazing amount of support. Thanks so much. Appreciate that. All right, let's play this video beam. Uh, I should have room. My freaking control, my flight controllers on the floor. My freaking room's a mess. Uh. Hope my batteries aren't gonna die in my controller either. I really hate when that happens during gameplay. Why don't you just replace them right now, Austin, with new control with batteries? Because that would be a waste if they're not just shut up. Alright. Going dark. Or going light. Oh for you know. Turn this off, that's for sure. glitch out like it was yesterday because uh the chat window that was really freaking annoying like the chat window was all janky and i couldn't get it like work properly it better not do that to me today it's like hey we updated the oculus app some things work worse now aren't updates supposed to you know make things work better or you know just not mess with things that worked in the past oh, I'm on the alert box freaking alert box no I'm not chat window there you are 
All right. Um, show me Twitch. Hey, it's not glitching out again. Thank you. All right, chat, where am I going to put you? No, it totally is glitching out. Are you serious? Are you freaking serious? That's hilarious. This never had this never had an issue in the past and now it does. Why? Oh, because All right, you should be good there. I can see you right now, so. You just gotta fiddle with it to make it show. Like, if you grab the window and move it around, it sits and flickers between showing the screen and not showing the screen. And depending on when you let go, it will either be showing the screen or not showing the screen, so you just gotta fiddle with it. Fiddle, fiddle, fiddle. Fit it, fit it, fit it. I need to open the window. It's going to get hot in here. And I'll do it when it gets hot. All right. I think we're close to beating this, to be honest. Put, I've put in a lot of good out, man, hours into it. Freaking. I think we're coming up on like 19 hours. What's the objective? Find the pump. Okay. All right. All we got to look for is pretty much just look for. Oh, can you see everything? Is everything good, chat? We good? Pretty much all we need to do is find human beings. Like peop like a lot of people with guns. And that'll be where my objective is. Because that's usually how it goes. I freaking hate this gosh dang sector section of the game though this this rainy world is just a nightmare didn't even bring my bow and arrow because that's just gonna be human beings the whole time alright I have a feeling this is where they're gonna be Um, it's shockingly quiet. There's nothing around, I'm, like, no zombies or anything. I'm, like, very surprised about that. Well, it's not in here. Does the speed ever increase? Well, I can always sprint like this. If that's what you mean by speed. My walking speed. I can sprint, but it's advisable not to because if the more you use your stamina right here, the more the, the, the maximum stamina will deplete. Like the more you use stamina type stuff, your stamina bar max will deplete. See how there's like a little notch there? That's already some depleted. The walking speed is pretty slow, though. Like, it's really slow. I wish you could have upgraded it somehow, because dang, it's some slow walking. Man. If there's no people around, I guess I'm just going to have to start looking in buildings. Because usually when there's an objective, there's tons of either zombies or people by the objective. So you have to fight your way through. But if there's, like, nothing here, I guess I'll just have to start looking inside every freaking building I come across. If we didn't come across... One zombie. It's crazy. Especially considering all the times I've come here and how miserable it's been with the amount of zombies. I always get my butt kicked when I come to this.
place. Come on. Well, at least it broke both of those. Gosh. I swear it's random, the, the force you have to apply there. Please. Oh, right. You're not pocketed. You're going to go in my backpack. I mean, should I be looting right now? I'm trying to find the objective here. everything the game updated today maybe it broke <laughs> on this update we decided to get rid of all the zombies and human beings in the level oh jeez this hot fix removes all enemies All right, I'll explore this big old building then. I am not even joking when I think I, when I say I think the game's bugged. There's nothing there's nothing. It's just a barren world of nothing. I haven't seen one zombie. One zombie. Whoa, hi. Maybe I should go, like, check the forums and see if people are, like, saying, uh... Your hop fix got rid of all the zombies. <laughs> Wait, I think I hear a zombie. Yeah, I definitely hear a zombie. Gosh dang it, that's crazy. It took that long. Looking for the dang pump, dang it. It said it was in this area. Like, I'm not crazy, right? Bastion. That's where I'm at, right? <laughs> yes. I think that zombie might be up here. Oh, here's the objective. What the? You made it. I didn't doubt that you would, of course, but my patience was beginning to be tested. <laughs> Let's start with a formal introduction. You are the tourist, and I. I'm Jean Baptiste, JB for short. There now, we can proceed to matters of more profound consequence. It is my understanding that this gizmo here would be of use to you. It's all yours. Consider it a gift. And when we are finished with our conversation, I will provide you with the missing dial that you'll need to operate it. Sound fair? Sounds fair. Terrific. Now, I prefer to play it straight. Once I received word that you were collecting these devices, and to what purpose, I saw an opportunity to connect with the city's most illustrious survivor and have a chat about the reserve. So I made it a priority to acquire one through various means I will not divulge. 
And now here you are. It is my hope when I am through, you will see the reserve for what it is. Nothing more than a crutch holding back the people of this fine city from regaining. You know what's funny is I could just straight up kill this dude. You've piqued my interest. Go on. I am a firm believer. Oh! That does this. I was gonna listen to you. I'm gonna break you, fool. I died on purpose, by the way. I totally died on purpose because I wanted to hear what he had to say. I know that there's no zombies, so I can just run straight there now. I accidentally brushed him with my axe. My bad. And it's officially hot in here. Time to open the window. Oh. No, chat, you moved. How did you, why did you move? Oh my gosh, chat, you disappeared now. I love it. Stay there. Don't disappear. Okay. All right. Well, I know what to do. I think that the the emptiness is like, you know, it's purposeful. I think after I talk to this guy, I might get ambushed by like every freaking guy in the freaking world. Wish I still had that axe. Tell you what. Wait. Where am I? Uh, spawn me in a different spot. I think? Yeah, whatever. That door's blocked. Thank you for the follow. All right, I can't die. I got some precious box of stuff. I cannot die this round. Do not die. Well, oh, I just realized there's not even a timer, chat. <laughs> I could loot this entire world, man. Cause there's no timer. I don't need to though, I'm fine. No need to exploit. I'm already fine on materials. They need to make a hardcore mode for this game. Either like less resources or more zombies or something. Don't get me wrong, it hasn't been easy. By any means it hasn't been easy. But it would be cool for a harder mode for kicks. You made it. I didn't doubt that you would, of course. But my pa Keep it brief. I'm busy. I won't take much of your time. You have my word. We all have business to attend to. Now, I prefer to play it straight. Once I received word that you were collecting these devices, and to what purpose, I saw an opportunity to connect with the city's most illustrious survivor and have a chat about the reserve. So I made it a priority to acquire one through various means I will not divulge. And now here you are. It is my hope when I am through, you will see the reserve for what it is. Nothing more than a crutch holding back the people of this fine city from regaining themselves. You've piqued my interest. Go on. I am a firm believer in the greatness of humankind. Our ingenuity, our art, our towering scientific achievements. This reserve nonsense, even if the rumors about what may be inside it exceed our wildest dreams, the bounty will only prolong our addiction to survivalism as the only path in life. It will stifle our creativity. It will eventually lead to 
to our withering doom. Now, this is the proposal that I have for you. Continue your search for the reserve. And when you unearth it, which I have the utmost confidence you will, destroy it. These four numbers will disable the entire flood contingency system. Mother Nature will rage through the reserve and take care of the rest. One, zero, zero, six. Flood the reserve and set us all free. Give this still glorious city the jumpstart it needs to refocus on something much grander than mere survival. Grant us hope, tourist, and thank you. Most sincerely for hearing me out. And let's keep this chat between us, if that's all right. Okay, where's I'm the dial? I'm not sure my comrades would see the big picture benefits of removing the reserve from the equation. The floor's now yours, my friend. Anything on your mind that requires clarity? I'm curious about the reclaimed. Yes. I've heard snippets about the reclaimed philosophy, but it would be enlightening to hear it from you. It's simple, really. We want to live purposeful lives, reclaim the world and our humanity along with it. Mere survival is so petty. It's beneath us, forcing people to focus solely on survival. It's cruel, really. I believe we must invest in a future of our own design. Life is not worth living otherwise. What's with the gory rituals? First one was a man I knew well in my brief tenure as a tower grunt. I'd even called him a friend. Trip was his name. Snuck up on me in the middle of sleep. Tried to slip my throat. Still carry the scar. We had a long story short. Trip was no match for me. I maimed him. Something awful, really. And I dragged his body about a mile all the way to the southern bump which at the time was the most highly trafficked exit from the tower. I found an old oak, hung him upside down from it so his lifeblood would spill rapidly into the soil. And upon his chest, I pinned a note that read, Keep him coming. And just like that, I became the most feared boogeyman Nola has seen since the Axeman. Once I had fear on my side, the rest just blossomed naturally. Those with nowhere else to go wanted what I had, so they listened. And they learned. I empowered them. That's all people want. A sense that their lives still have some meaning. The reclaimed have made quite a mark on the city. How did the movement get started? After my exile from the tower for insubordination, I took to raiding their supply lines. Rather efficiently, I might add. No one ever got hurt, and other exiles clamored to join my operations. Needless to say, Mama and her cohorts were not pleased with my exploits, and they sent several communications asking me to cease my pillaging or there'd be consequences. <laughs> of course, I refused, politely. No one was going to dictate the terms of my existence anymore. But it wasn't until the tower started sending thugs out to track me down and in me that I decided it was time to send a message of my own. I have some other questions for you, JB. I want your perspective on the reserve. Uh-huh. How did you find this code to flood the reserve? One of my scouts came across the corpse of a National Guardsman in Rampart High School. The body had a manual for a bunker's flood defense system. I put two and two together. If the rumors about what's inside the reserve are true, wouldn't it benefit the reclaimed to get your hands on it? You are absolutely correct. But once those supplies are gone, then what? The same old fruitless pursuits. And there is the very distinct possibility that the tower gets to it before we do. The only way to guarantee this city will move forward in the proper direction is to remove the reserve from the equation entirely. Why choose me to destroy the reserve? Because you're the one best equipped to find the accursed place, and I trust you will do the right thing when you do. Call it a hunch. 
I have some other questions for you, JB. I've heard enough. Fair enough. Then we are finished here. The Dao, as promised. Godspeed, tourist. <laughs> now, I mean, I'm still most likely barring anything else. Still gonna go with the reserve. You know? I made friends with Wuss's face. I've gone this far. My whole freaking goal was to get to the reserve so I can get to the supplies. His freaking idea that the supplies will just stunt the growth of whatever the frick he's trying to build here is stupid. Supplies lead to more productivity. Because you're more comfortable. Ooh, heck yeah. You know? Also, I'm not doing this for anyone, really, for me, but me. The whole goal is just to survive. I'm not aligning with any of those dudes. I guess you could say I am aligning with, uh, what the frick's his name? The stupid kid in the bunker. I'm helping him out, and that's pretty much it. But only because it benefits me to get access to the reserve. May as well loot this house before I leave. Just get what I can, and... Go back to the base. and whatever. I wonder what would happen if I killed him. You know? What the frick would have happened if I just killed him outright right there? Like, story-wise, you know? Like, what the frick would that have done? I had no real reason. Well, eh. I didn't really have a reason to kill him. How many bathrooms does this house house have? All right. I'll bet you if I killed him, these guys would have stormed the place and killed me. I'll bet you I wasn't After able to. Hype, you're not exactly what I expected. Thought you'd be more put together, a bit more danger to your presence. Sorry to disappoint, lady. Good thing I'm not too concerned about what you think of me. You should be, fool. Your life may depend on it. I'm Georgia. Maybe you heard of me, maybe not. I could give two shits. What does concern me is the man inside the building you just stepped out of. The time has come to silence him once and for all. Whoa, Cut what? Cut off the head that won't shut up. Rest of the reclaimed fools will fall back in line. Then us tower folk can get back to doing what's right. Without all the noise. From what I know about JB, it may take more than you and a couple of goons to take him down. You a real smartass, tourist. I fucking love smartasses. Especially when I've snipped the tongues out of their smartass mouths. But I'm willing to give you a pass on your smart-ass ways. Just this once. I'm gonna offer you an opportunity to be a hero. You game? That depends. What the fuck do you want me to do? Quit fucking with me, fool. You know what I want. 
march back up into that house and kill JB. Prove you are worth more to the tower than uh, the cockroach you've been so far. You guys are and the last return, people that I would all side your with. Fucked up transgressions will be forgiven. The last people. If you people happen that to find yourself with. in the midst of our onslaught on the reserve, tower troops will have your back. You have my word. This is your conflict, not mine. I'm not a hired gun for the tower. That's a goddamn shame, tourist. JB is not walking out of that place alive. I don't care. Involved or not. What I don't care. Realize don't kill him. Is your fate if you defy me. Let me clarify. Do as you are told or you are dead. Nothing better. Nothing better. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do this, and you can't do anything about it. See this? See this? Kablam! Now what? Now what? Now what? Kill JB or warn JB. So, if I walk away, these guys are gonna blow me away, huh? I'm not doing either. You know? That's the Taurus? Doesn't look so tough. My object, my ob my my options are to kill him or warn him. Wandering around? I ain't warning him. I don't care about him, and I'm not killing him because I don't care to kill him. I'm bailing. Can I bail? Whew, shit, this. Walk I might. And we won't. Hey, Get the leave, fuck asshole. Great. Great. Yeah, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna help these guys. I, I'm just gonna warn him. Screw it then. I'll fight with this dude. I don't care about him at all. Wait a minute. Holy crap! There's just no way I can get out of here. There's no way I can bail. I have to do one or the other. I wonder if I... I mean, if I shoot the, my way out, then it's just... It's the same thing as siding with JB. It's the same thing as siding with this dude. You've returned. To what do I owe the pleasure, tourist? Dang it, chat. I don't like him. I don't like him. I don't like the tower. I don't want to side with either of them. You know? What if I warn him and then kill him after we kill everybody? I don't want to frickin' side with either of these suckers. I just don't. Here to kill you? Just shoot him. Don't say it. Tower troops are outside. They want you dead. I suggest you get out of here. Well, look at you, tourist. Choosing sides. I suppose that's a good sign regarding our previous conversation. <sighs> Not for choosing our old sides! Spirit, you certainly have proven pivotal in the fight for the soul of this godforsaken and still glorious city. I have no designs on escape. I plan to march right out of this house, gun drawn, and send a message. If you feel like joining me, I suggest you keep up. When it comes to violence, I am decisive and swift. I mean. Wow, he is swift. He just vanished. Kill JB and take down Georgia and her crew? Both? I could end both things here, chat. I could help him out. I could shoot my way out and then end him with... I'll tell you what I'm gonna do, though. I'm gonna have to take some jambalaya. Mm. I need as much ammo. I don't have that much ammo for this. Got plenty of shotgun ammo, though. Here we freaking go. Well, the back door had less enemies, so. Like, do I just start shooting? Like, the frick, guys. He 
He left you to die? Yeah, where is he? All right, I'm walking out of here. If anyone has a problem with that, last chance. Get the fuck out before I kill you. If anyone has a problem with that, then we're going to have a problem. I wonder how fast these guys will mobilize back here once I start shooting. Increase my health. Mm. All right. Here we go. All right, we're full. Don't be stupid. That wasn't so bad. I just, I just realized that my speakers are on. So my freaking audio is probably echoing. Yeah, the mission's over. So I didn't do either of them. I didn't side with anybody, right? Thank you for the follow, by the way. Oh, yeah, I have no preference, dudes. I'm not siding with either of those guys. I'm siding with dumb kid here, whatever his name is. Casey was his name, right? Yeah. I'll side with frickin' Casey. And that's that. Thanks, whoever that gave me that. Chat, have you ever had jambalaya? It is like one of the most amazing foods out there. It's too good. It's spicy? No, it's freaking not. You want spicy Mexican food. I'm back, Casey. Ready to repair the pump. You still alive? Yeah, alive, but almost swimming. No turning back after this, tourist. We have to get after it. I'm running out of time. You prepared? I'm ready. Okay, serial number first. For frick's sakes. 749-0003-13. All right, um, set valve A to 38. Valve A, 38. Green. Valve B needs to be set at 44. Oh, it's... 
Valve B, 44, A, B, double green. You're a machine, tourist. Okay, Valve C, set it to 60. Valve C to 60, green all around. Button press and we are calibrated. Excellent, okay. The last pump is not far from the cemetery. It's in a concrete industrial shed in the old jazz park. Near the statue. The, the lights station. on! Should be easy to find. The key you got from May unlocks the door to the shed. Now once the part is installed, contact me and I'll get the pump system started. We are so close, tourist. Access to the reserve for you. Get the fuck out of the reserve for me. Oh, can't wait. May left me something. Man, this game's gonna is gonna have actually have replayability to it with there's like three factions you can choose total, you know? Tourist. Thank you. And goodbye. Maybe our paths will cross again. Oh, she's out, yeah. huh? Guess we'll just have to wait and see. Personally, I think you should follow us out of this doomed city. Like I said, you will be an asset to the Exodus. But you need to follow whatever story resides in your head. Just know that you are a part of my and Ombra's story. Along with the stories of a couple dozen folks who might have been dead by the end of the week if it wasn't for your efforts. Ombra wanted to give you one more drawing. I think she hopes it'll sway your decision. Good luck. And Where... I hope you find what you're searching for. May. Where is the jazz park? Is that an area I have to go to, or is it within this world? Because every time I had to install a pump, it's in this hub world area. The jazz park? I don't know what the frick that is. Yeah, there's no jazz park, so it's in this world, apparently. Okay. I think this is actually the end of the game right here. I actually think this is, like, the end. This is the end. It's kind of... I'm kind of sad. <laughs> Hope they actually have DLC or something for this game, because this is just too good. Um... Yep. All right. Well, let's prep. May as well bring all my crap, huh? Bring all my grenades. For frick's sakes. Um, here, whatever. Yeah, I'm good. I got everything I need. Guess I'll eat that jambalaya. Actually, I'll eat it when I get there, just in case. The jazz, oh, the park. I know where that is, okay. Yeah, that's just over here. Let me guess, two zombies right here. I was right! Right in the eyes. Doink! Doink! What the? Where's the jambalaya? Get the code for that safe over there. I had to make sure if she was diseased or not. I was like, let me look at your pearly whites. Don't look a gift zombie in the mouth. What? 
Not this door. I thought for sure that would be it. This is a park. There's jazz players. This is jazz park. What does it mean drawn hints or do you think there's a, I have a code for this? I don't know where I'm supposed to go. What was that key for? All of this is, all of these are invisible walls. I can't go beyond any of this. I thought for sure it would be in there. I can't go anywhere else. What is that key for then? I have another key. Oh, did I really overlook that? Oh, good call. Good call, pizza. I didn't see that. Okay. Gosh, I would have just left here and never would have known what the frick to do. Now what do I do after this? Contact Casey, I guess. Open the reserve. Well, this is it. This is it. I didn't even need that jambalaya. I thought this would be a freaking war zone. Wasted that jambalaya. At least it was tasty. I really want jambalaya right now. There was this freaking bistro that used to be er, er, close, and it was the best freaking restaurant of all time. It was like that kind of southern food, like like freaking jambalaya and just like that gator. It was like the best freaking restaurant on the planet. And the freaking chef was just an a-hole. Like the guy was just ornery, not personable, very rude. And then they just shut down, and I heard because the guy just didn't want to do it anymore. The chef was just like, I'm sick of this. It's like, oh, I hate you. I freaking hate you. Casey, come in. It's go time. Awesome, tourist. Never doubted you. That's a load of bullshit, Casey. Well, sure, there were a few times I doubted you. Four hours? Today. I'm like, wrong. I'm like on hour 20 right now. So no, it's not four hours long. You never know. Guess we need to be prepared for anything. It's not okay, short. What are you, why are you just assuming this is short? I'm gonna power everything up. It should work, but... I am legit on hour like 18 or 19 of this game. Okay, here it goes. Fingers short. Oh, yes! It's working! What a fucking relief! I can hear the pumps firing up overhead. Oh, which swear word, chat? Hmm. Oh, fuck. Wait, what? Well, what's the problem? Something going on out there? Yeah. St. Vincent's Church just lit up. Can see it all the way from here. The location of the reserve is no longer a secret, Casey. Fireworks, marching band, and a big neon sign flashing the reserve might have Wait, been more Wait, Slimey, why did you say two to three? Why did you say that? I need to get the fuck out of here. Now. God damn it, tourist. I still can't open the door. Okay, okay, uh, uh think, Casey, think. Uh, uh Slimy Pete's has been uh, here for nearly uh, every stream for like the past two weeks I've been playing this. The pump system knows where to redirect the water. I play like uh, three hours a night. A manual flow control inside the church. Now, you need to get over here quick. Open the valve to one of the rooms so the water has a place to go. Then the doors will unlock, and I can get the hell out, tourist. Please, please. I don't want to be stuck in this place when a bunch of nuts with guns show up feeling greedy. And neither do you. Alright. It's about to get... busy. Well, I may as well just bring this one. I'm going to be on ammo before this thing breaks. Shotgun. Pistol. Sword. 
This is the final battle, I do believe. Yeah, this game's been amazing, man. And the, I think the length's perfect. It's like a 20-hour game. And you can make it longer if you wanted. You could just go and freaking loot areas if you want. Find the secret recipes. I never found all the secret recipes. There's a gosh, I think I can make the assault rifle and I didn't find the recipe for that. If these two zombies are here again, I swear, okay. All right. Is it gonna be zombies or humans? Probably both. Whoa, 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 don't crash game. I see what was happening, it was loading the next area. Here we go. I didn't want to die. Forgive what? me. Please. Wait, is that me? Who died? Um, she ran after her mom as they were taking her away. Oh, no. It's gonna give me a choice here, isn't it? Crossfire. Where's Ombra's mother? Where's May? I don't know. She ran off. Wait, she killed Into May or Amber? We, we were desperate to get back into the tower. You freaking we, we killed thought... a kid? We, we thought if we turned May in, the tower would take us back. Take care of us. We fucked up. I warned them. That was a terrible idea. This is something would I buy would DLC for this game? The second it comes out, yes, I would. I, listen. I hope it gets DLC because I don't want this game to end. It's so freaking good. I fucked up so bad. Fuck you. <laughs> that was an overdramatic kill. Oh, good freaking Lord. Was that her? Was this Amber? That's a unique zombie I've never seen. I think that might have been Amber. Ambry, whatever the frick her name was. I don't know. The way she talked, I thought that the daughter was a young girl. Maybe I'm wrong. That might not have been her. Oh, chat. We going... We going to fight some... Zombos, some humans. Man, this uh, this gun's kind of inaccurate. Oh, jeez, I'm hitting the wall there. Gosh dang war zone out here. I re what? That magazine was empty. You know what? Time to go for old faithful here.
dare you to climb that ladder. Why am I hearing so much screaming? What the frick? Uh-oh. I think a lot of zombos might have just showed up. The tower's been... What? What happened to the tower? The tower got compromised? How? <clears throat> no, you can aim. You can literally... I can literally get headshots if I aim down the iron sights. It's quite nice. Very satisfying headshots, too, if you oh. get them. <sighs> I hear Casey. I'm here, Casey. At the controls. Oh, thank God. Okay, uh, uh, I'm not sure how much time we have left before my room is underwater. Activating the pumps just fucked everything up. The room is filling up fast. Look, look, um, I need you to redirect the flood flow to the armory. A and quick. Look, I know I promised you oh. all the weapons you'd ever be able to carry, but I... I'm sorry. We have to let them go. What happened with the pumps? I went through all that trouble for nothing? I, I don't know what happened. Maybe the system was already pushed too far. Point is, you need to redirect the flow, and now, or I am dead. I know I sold you a bill of goods that I can't deliver on anymore, and that sucks. I'm sorry. But this is my life we are talking about here, tourist. Flood the armory. Please. All right. Oh, it worked! Holy shit! Thank you, tourist. Oh, for a second I thought I could have oh, flooded all never of them. Mind. The door unlocked. <laughs> I'll head up and meet you in the church. Fresh fucking air. Watch him just die. Establish a perimeter. Flush out any reclaimed stragglers. No mercy. Round up this guy. Fill out those camps. This is power choice. Who the fuck rang the bell? Shit! Heard it close. Just up the fucking street. Voice is down. You draw their attention, you gonna get slaughtered. We gotta get the church over the What if I didn't have any fucking items to do this? I'd literally be stuck here. Back off! Take one step toward me and I really ring the bell. Every walker in a five mile radius will descend upon this place and tear everyone apart. You don't want to do that. Just because we're safe in here, Is that me? you can ring that bell and kill all those people. That you, tourist? Oh, thank God. Look, you have to talk some sense into her. If she rings that bell... Didn't you hear them out there? Needlessly slaughtering each other when they should be unified. They have always been stupid and cruel. Even before the world went to shit. Their fucked up philosophies. Their petty treachery. Even the innocent. Their pathetic desperation. They all twisted my priorities. Blinded me to the truth. I should have been looking after me and mine all along. 
I allowed them to take her away from me. They are the reason my daughter is dead. May, you shouldn't do this. It won't bring Ambra back, and you're not a murderer. Taurus, she's lost it. Listen to her. We can't let her ring that bell. One of us has to kill her. Please, don't force me to do it. I'm glad you're here, Taurus. To bear witness. The slate needs to be wiped clean. We are out of time! Drown in death, motherfuckers! Thanks for stopping her, tourist. I'm not sure I could have brought myself to do it. I was not about to let her kill innocent people. No matter what happened to me. You did the right thing. I'm just sorry it had to happen. It's eerie. All this going down right here? In this church? Same spot as... before. I know it doesn't really mean anything, there's no connection, but... Huh. It still has my skin crawling. Is this really the time? Knowing all those bodies from the massacre, just... Right over there. Part of me wants to confront it. Pay respects. Another part of me wants to run out the door. I'm sorry about the reserve, tourist. I made a promise I couldn't deliver. There might be a few things down there to scavenge, but anything really valuable? Well, it's gone. Hey, you may as well check, though. I'm gonna head my own way. I've been cooped up so long, I just feel like I need to get moving. Get out of this swamp and head back north. Hey. Thanks again, tourist. You saved my life. I won't forget it. Uh. I don't care about any of that, Casey. What's important is that you made it out. I'm gonna head down to the reserve, see what I might be able to scrounge up. Good luck to you. Hope you make it north safely. Watch, wouldn't it be insane if, like, Casey was, like, not who he said he is? That is so likely to happen. I could be wrong. He's, it all seemed genuine. I mean, his freaking, his war buddy confirmed it anyway. Like, his, his war buddy isn't going to be lying about him either, so... For frick's sakes, I can't carry any of this. Fully frickin' loaded shotgun. Well, may as well replace it. is what now like what now I was about to say, can you imagine a Fallout game like this? Fallout 4 has a VR version. <laughs> Doesn't have very good reviews either. It's Bethesda for you. You read the reviews and they're like, it's good with mods. Skyrim has decent reviews. 
Skyrim VR. Climb this with this sword. I one handed it. That's it, huh? So this, this is definitely the best VR game I've played to date. Granted, I've only had VR for like three months. <laughs> this is 1000% the best, one of the best VR game experiences you will get. If you get VR, freaking get this game. What a fantastic freaking v v VR game, man. Man, that's good. I hope it gets more rec. I mean, it is getting good recognition because I heard through the grapevine, essentially, everyone's like, man, this game's good. Uh, have you heard about this? This game's great. Yeah, this was, uh, I think it was like a, I think it was 20 hours. I'll check after I'm done, but I think it was a 20 hour game. It, I'm kind of, I wish there was more. <laughs> I hope that they make more of these or do a DLC. Could easily make more, right? Just a whole new story with no new leads, etc. Chat, this game is so good. Holy frick. New game plus would be too easy. Gosh dang it, my flashlight's buzzing. I need to, I need to shake my flashlight. New Game Plus would be too easy and boring, I think. Oh, oh this game was so good! I'm just thinking back on all the freaking amazing, amazing times I had with it. could have sided with multiple three different freaking factions I could have sided with so I mean there's definitely replayability in that regard kind of want to just play through it again <laughs> what a freaking good game man I love when games just leave me with that freaking Holy crap, amazing feeling. What a freaking game. Can I skip this? <clears throat> Sorry, credits, but I'm going to skip you. Guess I can't. Wait, what? One week later, what's this? Oh, so I can just keep going. <sighs> There's nothing left, but I can just keep playing. I like that idea. Oh, look, the freaking sword came with me. Holy crap, that's amazing. Well, I can't, I can't put this on the rack. There we go. That's freaking, that's great that I can keep going. Medical cash confirmed. 
the shallows. You know, if I want to complete my recipes, find all the recipes. Oh, the band. I could have gone to like the music room at the school to find that one. Man, I could see, like you could just keep going to see how long he could last pretty much, which would be pretty cool. Get all the recipes. There might be like little hidden side quests, you never know. What a freaking good freaking video game. I loved it. Unfortunately, I don't know what to play now. Deus Ex? That's a random game to play. You know, do, I don't think I have it installed, do I? I don't think that I do. I would like to try Subnautica out in VR. This would probably be really cool in VR. I should install this. Ace Combat would not make a good streaming game. Trust me. None of you would... None of you would want to watch me play Ace Combat. It would just be endless. It would be pretty much just be a screen spinning the whole time. Like, you'd just be watching, a, like, the world spinning constantly. That would make a horrible viewing experience. Are there any mods that can change the game title? I'm not playing Subnautica. I don't have any mods that can change the game, do I? That sucks. Gonna have to start making more mods able to change the game title. Oh, shaved there. Shaved. Change it. Just change it to Skyrim. I'll hop into Skyrim. Why the frick not? Don't know how much longer I'll play tonight, but we'll just goof around in some Skyrim. Some Elder Skrills Skyrim. I don't even know. Oh, yeah! I remember I left off. I was about to fight some liches, I think. No, just some conjurers. Alright. What's a good spell I can give to him? How about Mag Tumble Magnet? Did I put that in my right hand? Yeah. Gosh, I couldn't remember what my controls were there for a minute. All right, Tumble Magnet wasn't doing the trick. I thought it would kill them instantly when they fell from the roof. How about Twister?
Wow, this guy ain't freaking messing around. Jeez. Oh, I could open the VR toolkit and have chat that way, and then I couldn't. I. It's chain lightning, actually. Healed. Blah. Does that freaking thing? Oh, it does spawn. They don't even summon the dang thing. I'm disappointed. Ah! Oh my good lord! What's on your mind? I need to do something. Hold on. Um. This is what I'm gonna do. Uh, unpin you. Close it. I'm gonna have to exit out of this. What a pain in the butt. Open up OVR. Eh, it's not even there. No, stop. Just freaking work with me. There's OVR. And then re re oh, turn this on. There we go. Now, chat, you should be right here. There we go. Never seen the twister spell because it's a mod. Everything in this game I do is a mod. These girls are mods, their boobs are mods. Was that journal? Blah 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 blah. Well, you had a lot to write, didn't you? It's a darn shame I don't care to read it. I'm still over encumbered. Jeez. All right. Open up the old magical chest. Uh, put that hammer in there. What are you giving me here? Final stage to fire breath, finally. I don't really need any more music in this game. I spent hours and hours making my own music soundtrack. It's done. I finally did like I like did a lot. <laughs> what was I in here for? Well, I hope I achieved what I was in here for. Whoops! It 
Is there something I can help you <clears throat> with? I think I have a set. What is this objective? Oh, I guess I got distracted. Of course I did, heading to this frickin' objective. Of course I did. Well, where is it? What even is it? Yeah. I keep looking up to see chat, but I can just do this now. Sex mods are all right. I love how when you come here, it's just like every freaking guard is just there. Who am I heading towards here? Oh, okay. War is not new to Falkry. Thank you. It's a collection of regrets that I try not to forget. Here, I promise you this. I'll teach you some of what I know, but be careful. Some loud hammering. Why are you just hammering? Okay. I have so many stupid miscellaneous quests, so I've just been trying to tackle some of them. Now, chat, are there any freaking Skyrim experts here? This says talk to the companion's leaders for work, and they just endlessly give me stupid quests. Go kill this dude. Go fight a giant. Will that ever disappear? Also, the assist the people of, I can never frickin' figure out how to finish these. Assist, assist the people of Falkreath, two of three. Who else haven't I assisted here, dang it? They don't go away, huh? So just ignore them. Yeah, and the assist people of blank, I'm always like stuck on these. I don't know what the frick. Like, who needs more assistance in Falkreath? I don't know. I thought I accepted all the quests in this area. I can't believe we let provincials like you wander Skyrim. Shut the frick up. Chad, did you just hear that? <laughs> Please clip that. I need someone to clip that, please. I know exactly what that was. It's a YouTube video of a freaking goat screaming. I got a freaking. It's one of my mods is a like an ambience mod where like the dog barking you're hearing. It's part of the ambience mod, and I guess they decided, oh, I'll add a scream, the screaming goat in part of the ambience. I've is never heard that. I have never heard that. Been playing this for like a hundred and thirty hours, and I'd never have heard that. I was Yaro once. I'm right behind you. What can I do for you? Someone clipped it, right? It just was very unexpected. Assist the people of Falkreath. Who? Who? Who haven't, do I, is it a miscellaneous quest? See, that's the thing, it's like, it's just like, find blah blah, identify, speak with, and it's like, well, are these people of Falkreath? I don't freaking know. Locate Raider's remains, is that Falkreath? I'll, I'll locate Ra Raider's, Raider's remains.
That ain't Falkreath. What's on your mind? And there's all the flipping guards side by side when I load in every frickin' time. Wait, I remember this quest. Why didn't I ever do it? Holy crap, it's been like a hundred hours since I've been here, and the quest is just right here. Remember in, like, Morrowind, if it said locate Raida's remains, it would not show you where it was. You would just physically have to search for it. I kind of like that and dislike that at the same time. Morrowind had no quest markers, ever. You had to read a journal and then figure out where to go and how to find it from there. No quest markers, nothing to indicate where to go. It would literally be like, would literally be like, you need to do oh, this Rada. and this. I miss Rada. She was so nice to Narfi. Narfi said he can't be with Rada. I'm sorry, she's dead. Oh no, 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 no. Narfi never got to say goodbye. Now Narfi's all alone. At least Narfi has Rada's necklace. Reminds Narfi of his sister. Thank you for giving this to Narfi. Human flesh added. What well, thanks, bro. Thanks so much for the human flesh. Was that Falkreath? This is not Falkreath. Is it the region of Falkreath? I don't know. Is this the people of the Pale? Where's the Pale? Like, I'm just having to do, like, all this crap because I don't know what the frick location there for. It should say when you hover over it, like, location. You know? Like, still the private letter for Dengar. What the frick is this? I keep pressing the wrong button. Please, Austin. Please press the right button this time. Wait, this is Falkreath. <gasps> this is the people of Falkreath. Wait, what is this? Well, I'm stealing something, so I guess I'll break in. Can't hide when there's like a thousand people. Die, Lord God. Um, excuse me? Excuse me? Hey, people, we got a... Everyone, we got a vampire here. Vampire. Oh my frick! Kill him first, he's the summoner! Kill the summoner! There you go! That's not what I equipped. He's gonna kill me now! I'm dead. I'm sorry. No, now they're aggro on me. They <laughs> just ignore the vampire and start attacking my companion. Look, she's dead. Okay, she's dead. Can we all calm down? Oh, listen, it was an accident. Friendly fire. Freaking friendly fire, you morons. Just some vampire shows up in Falkreath, walks up to me. Die. Alright, you know what? You're mine. Good lord, that's a sturdy sucker. Oh, my game crashed. I like it. When the game crashes, man, this game rarely crashes on me. Of course, now that I'm in VR, it's totally gonna, or now that I'm streaming, it's totally gonna crash.
Well, Pierce. Wait, no, close app, please. All right, you know what? I think I'm just gonna end the stream for tonight. I'm getting all sweaty. <sighs> Very annoyed. Well, we did beat the Walking Dead. I'm I'm not gonna know what to stream now for the next freaking week. Thanks for all the followers tonight, by the way. Calcular Five, thanks for the resub. <laughs> I got a freaking ton of followers tonight. What the frick? Why did you guys follow me tonight? Out of curiosity, you new followers, how come you followed me tonight? There was quite a strew of them, stew of them. Four, by the way. I have to take this headset off. It's freaking making me sweaty. Why? It's getting too warm already. I'm not looking forward to summertime with VR. Summertime with VR is going to be a freaking nightmare. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to use VR in the summertime. Oh, if you holster, they'll stop? Well, that's nice to know. Alright, Jet. Have a good night. Thanks for watching. See ya. Tomorrow. Thanks again for the resubs, the follows, all the good stuff. Thank you. Good night. Short stream, I know, but... I don't know what to do after beating that game. I need to reflect on it. Sorry for the short stream. Uh, follow me on Twitter. Follow my Discord. All that stuff. If you want to know when I'm live or what's going on with my life. I do stream every night at the same time to the new followers out there. So Every night I stream. If you want to come on in. Follow my freaking Twitter. I don't know why I was talking to the followers. I just played an ad. They can't even see that. Here it is. Good job, Austin.